What is going on guys? Grave here. Today I'll talk about the seals of the Endeavor because it seems a lot of people think that they got nerfed over not considering yesterday we were able to get 60 seals today we're only going to get 45 if we go down here and kind of look uh you know at what the dailies are today and of course we're only getting 15 seals per daily so you're only going to get a total of 45 for doing those three dailies a lot of people think that zoss nerfed this overnight and that is not the case um they did state back several months ago when they first announced the seals of the endeavor coming to the game and i will link this article down in the description if you would like to read it that the daily or weekly endeavors you can complete each day or week will vary. So be sure to check out what the current cap is. Uh, that way you can figure out what endeavors you want to take on for that day or for the week. So this is going to vary from day to day. Like yesterday, we could get a total of 60. Today, we only get a total of 45. But as you see, like today, we're getting 15 uh, seals per daily quest done and a little bit of an extra bonus. So some days you may get XP, some days you may get gold. They even talked about some days they could be down to almost only five seals per, you know, per daily. So it looks like we're going to have a varying amount depending on the day, depending on the week. I wish Zoss would put out a, some type of article with some info on it saying, look, this is going to be the max amount that you're going to be able to get some days. This is going to be the, the minimum amount you're going to be able to get some days. And this is going to be the max or minimum amount for the weeklies because we're not sure what the weeklies reward is going to be yet. I know in general, a lot of people are upset with the whole process of the seals. Uh, they thought they were going to be able to get, I think, better rewards quickly. That's really not what I thought. I pretty much thought it was going to be the way it is. I kind of figured that it was going to be insane for a Radiant Apex, just considering they want a lot of gems for a Radiant Apex. You're going to have to pay several thousand gems for a Radiant Apex, like 1,600 plus. So when it, when it comes to Seals of the Endeavor, I was expecting this to be something that would take probably six months to a year to grind out. So if you're really going to want a Radiant Apex, you're probably going to have to log in every day unless the weeklies give some insane amount of, of uh, Seals of the Endeavor. You're probably going to be grinding six months to a year to be able to ever get a Radiant Apex mount. Now, yesterday I did buy a few of the crates. Uh, as you can see, I didn't get any Radiant Apexes. I actually ended up purchasing the Iron Atro Polymorph with some of the crown gems that I had. I also, of course, got a few items down here, as you can see in the legendary rewards and a lot of items out of the epic rewards, a lot of duplicates. I ended up buying 30 boxes. Uh, I bought those with in-game gold. I do buy uh, crowns from time to time. I've only ever done it just a handful of times, just, you know, just a few to buy like four to eight boxes, maybe. Sometimes I will use my crowns that I get from ISO Plus to buy boxes. But the majority of the time when I purchase crates, I buy them with in-game gold. I buy them from people that I know that actually sell their crowns. Uh, the kind of point I'm getting to here is the reason that I expected uh, for all this to be like it is, is I've only ever got one Radiant Apex and I've played the game uh, for almost seven years now. I started playing here on console about six months after it released, so I'm going on seven years of playing the game now. And I've only ever received one Radiant Apex. I know that it's RNG, but we only have about a 0.5% chance of getting a Radiant Apex out of a box anyway. So I was not really expecting them to just give out Radiant Apexes for Seals of the Endeavor easily. I was expecting it to be a big grind. My feelings towards this whole Seals of the Endeavor thing, like I said, was pretty much like it is. I was not expecting anything great out of it. I know a lot of people are disappointed with the system, but it's pretty much how I expected the system to go. I think Zoss, and this is just my opinion, of course, uh, decided to do this whole thing because there's a lot of countries out there that are putting bans on games with loot boxes in them, whether it be first person shooters or even ESO. If there's any type of crate that you can buy, they consider it gambling. So I think what Zoss was trying to do is say, look, we're going to put a system in that's going to allow you to get these items by just playing the game. And that way we can't call it, you know, that way it won't be labeled as gambling. I think that's kind of what they're doing. That's just my opinion. Like I said, it may not be the case, but it's kind of how I feel about it. But I know overnight since we got 30, like I said, we're getting, you know, up to 60, um, excuse me, 60 uh, seals yesterday. I think a lot of people thought that it got nerfed overnight. I think people thought, wow, they went from 60 to 45 today. That's pretty sorry in one day. But that's not the case. It's going to vary from day to day and from week to week. So just keep an eye on your seals every day because you never know how many you're going to get. Uh, and then, of course, once the weekly is added, maybe we can start to see how many seals we're going to be able to get within the month. Me personally, I'm hoping the weekly is something that is pretty difficult, something you have to get on and grind and do every day to get completed. And I would like to see a reward of uh, maybe 100 to 300 seals for the weekly. I don't think that's going to happen. I have a bad feeling that it's going to be kind of easy stuff and not going to really reward. I have a reward that's that great. We'll kind of have to wait and see. But anyway, guys, I hope this clarifies some things for you. They did not get nerfed overnight. It's just 
they are going to vary from day to day the amount of seals you get and the amount of gold and the amount of xp so some days it may be more seals some days it may be less seals and more gold and more xp anyway leave me a uh, comment with your thoughts and of course if you'd like to hit the like if you haven't subscribed yet please do so and i'll catch you next time peace